In this video, we are going to look at building a basic soft chalk lesson. I have created a lesson draft in Microsoft Office Word. The lesson draft contains the text and images used as instructional content. There are also instructor notes included as placeholders where soft chalk features will be added to the lesson. Also in this draft, word heading styles have been applied to the subject or topic headings. When the content is pasted into soft chalk, the heading styles will be maintained. First, select all of the content in the Word document and copy it. Then, in SoftChalk, paste the content. SoftChalk also has a text editing toolbar, so you can choose to draft in SoftChalk instead of a word processing program like Word. However, Word has a much more robust spelling and grammar checker than SoftChalk does. Drafting in Word may be easier. Notice that the headings have maintained the heading styles I applied in Word. The rest of the text is the plain text style. There is also already a style applied to this lesson. The green headings are a result of the lesson style. A style gives a lesson a professional look and also adds navigational tools and links to the lesson. To apply a style to a lesson, select Style Properties from the Properties menu. A long list of available style options and color schemes displays. I will apply the grayscale style. The headings automatically adjust to show the style colors. Save your lesson after making changes. Select Save As from the File menu to save your lesson for the first time. Use the Preview button on the toolbar or the Preview menu to preview a lesson in a web browser. So far, the preview for the lesson looks very similar to how it looks in the SoftChalk editor and how it looked as a Word document. The header or banner does reflect the grayscale style, though. To take full advantage of SoftChalk as a web based lesson builder, add in page breaks to create a multi page lesson. Make sure that the insertion pointer is on an empty line before inserting a page break. Select Page Break from the Insert menu. Continue adding page breaks as needed. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Control Enter to add page breaks. Remember to save your changes and preview your lesson to see the changes. In the lesson preview, a menu bar is now available which allows page navigation. Also, at the bottom of the page, text links are provided. The lesson still needs a title in the header or banner area. In SoftChalk, select Style Properties from the Properties menu. Since a style has already been applied, open the Title and Layout tab. Enter the lesson title in the text area provided. You can also customize the footer information and turn on the Table of Contents page option. There is also an option to provide a Print All Pages link to students so that they can print all of the text in the lesson as a single document. Save and preview your changes. Now the lesson opens to a Table of Contents page and the title appears at the top of the lesson. The footer information displays at the bottom. Use the Table of Contents links to launch the lesson. The Print All link is also available. You can very quickly go from a Word document 
to a basic web-based lesson using SoftChop.